Okay guys, so our first model was made with twisted strings as our power and we were saying over time those strings lose their power. So our first upgrade we're going to use an elastic band which will hopefully go around here and we will attach to our release mechanism. And we definitely have to upgrade our release mechanism as well. But for the moment, that'll be fine. Now guys, these ballistas are quite dangerous. So please only make them with your parents. And always remember to wear your safety glasses. Okay, thanks guys. Let's the upgrade, test one. Okay, so we had a few test fires there on the first upgrade. And we found that... We had to pull the elastic band back too far, a lot farther than this, to get the power. So I double wrapped the elastic band around the base. And now to get the power, we just have to pull it back to the end of the runway. Um, our catching mechanism has a little bit of wood missing off it. So only one side would really catch the elastic band. So we're now using the end of the runway as the the whole elastic band back and when we were firing the projectile we found it a little bit difficult to hold the projectile and the elastic at the same time so we added a bit of string to make it easier to pull the elastic band back and we were having um i was messing around with it there and i did hit the balloon but so now we have a new balloon and we're going to try and hit the balloon on the camera Okay guys, so as our experiments have gone on, we have decided that the bottom of the pointy sticks and the pencil are too small for the rope to catch. And it works out that the Nerf dart is nice and fat and it will fit into our holder perfectly without falling backwards. And it's safe. So our conclusion, one of our important conclusions for today was Instead of using pointy arrow type objects, it's re it does really, it even works better if you use Nerf darts, which are really safe. So I'm really happy about that. So when we're making more of our medieval weapons, we're going to be designing them to shoot Nerf, Nerf darts. Okay, so that's great. Now, what we have done is we've put elastic bands in here tw uh, and twisted them. That's how a ballista actually is supposed to work. It's, uh, they use ropes and then they twist the ropes to give it the, the power. 
So this is the official blister design. And what we've noticed is that it's not as powerful as the elastic band around it by itself. But the elastic band around it by itself is too powerful. You have no control. It's just it's too powerful. You can't. It's too powerful. It's too powerful. There's no. It's too uh, dangerous. Like it just fires off without any control. But this one doesn't have as much power. But it's definitely uh, more controllable. So we've. I can show you now what I did. I have just got an elastic band and wrapped it around the head of the blister three times. And then Pull it out and then shoot a fire the way that you want. Okay, so you tie the rope, you make little notches off the lollipop stick to catch the rope, the, the, the string, and make a little knot on the other side and make sure it's a little bit shorter than the two arms at full stretch. Create a bit of tension on the arms. Slip the knot around the arm. Now, we are having a little bit of trouble with one side being stronger than the other side, but we can adjust the length of the lollipop sticks to help that a little bit. And, okay, so. Uh, maybe this one. And now we're going to fire some Nerf darts. But before we do that, I'm just going to quickly explain that the base is just two lollipop sticks, two other lollipop sticks, one half cut down lollipop stick glued in between them. Uh, it's the same for the head. It's just two lollipop sticks, two lollipop sticks, and a third of a lollipop or a quarter of a lollipop stick glued in between them. And the runway is one lollipop stick with lollipop sticks glued up, up along the side of them. And lollipop stick glued to give it the angle. And that's it. And one three quarter size lollipop sticks for the arms. And just elastic bands for the to give it the power. Okay, so we're gonna shoot some nerf darts now and see how accurate we are. Slept here 